Hey guys, welcome to another video. Today we'll be looking at Ripple versus IOTA. Which cryptocurrency is the best for you in 2018? We'll be looking at their strengths and weaknesses to give you a better understanding of both of these coins. Just as a disclaimer, I'll let you guys know I own equal amounts of Ripple and IOTA, so I'll try to give you my unbiased opinion on both of these cryptocurrencies. And remember, only invest what you can actually afford to lose. So let's begin. Let's begin with a basic understanding of Ripple and IOTA. Ripple and IOTA both cannot be mined. And when they were created, they both had a predetermined number of coins that were going to be available in the market. But that is where the similarity ends. IOTA is focused on machine to machine transaction, while Ripple is focused on payment to payment transaction. IOTA is based on something called the Tangle and Ripple is based on blockchain technology, the, the technology that you have been hearing for quite a long time which other cryptocurrencies use such as Bitcoin, Litecoin and Ethereum. Now let's look at three things IOTA has to offer which Ripple falls short on. 1. No fees. The way IOTA has been designed is that whenever you're sending I IOTA from one account to another, there is no transaction cost, which no other cryptocurrency has been able to match, including Ripple, Bitcoin and others. So this is a huge positive point for IOTA. Number 2. The Tangle. IOTA has an upper hand when it comes to the technology that is powering it compared to the blockchain technology. Now that is what I personally feel, a lot of you can debate whether uh, I'm right or whether I'm wrong, but let me, let me give you why I think it is better than the blockchain technology. The more people that use Tangle, the better it becomes, the faster it becomes and the more secure it becomes, unlike the blockchain technology in which there is a limit to how many people can actually use it at a time, while there is no limit on how many people can use the Tangle. So it gives a huge advantage over the blockchain technology and kind of future-proofing IOTA network. Number three, future-proof. Whether you agree or disagree, we're going to come to the age of quantum computers and that is when IOTA will truly show its power. The, tang the, the Tangle, the technology that runs IOTA can even work during the quantum era, while blockchain technology will basically get smashed by the quantum computers because they will be able to easily destroy the encryption that secures them. But that is a bit far in the future. Now coming to Ripple. I have previously talked about Ripple in detail which you can click here to watch the previous video. But now let's compare it to IOTA. Number 1. Hype Whether you like or dislike Ripple, you have to agree that Ripple has more hype than IOTA. And when it comes to the cryptocurrency world, hype plays a huge part in determining its price. The higher, the more people are talking about it, the more people are likely to buy it. So Ripple kind of outdoes uh, IOTA here. Number 2. Financial Institutions Ripple is already being adopted by major banks from all over the world and at a much faster rate than any other cryptocurrency out there that includes IOTA and in the cryptocurrency world that matters a lot. Number 3. Availability Ripple is available in more major mainstream platforms compared to IOTA and that makes it easier for the average consumer to buy it, thus increasing the price of Ripple. In conclusion, if I had to pick IOTA versus Ripple, for many years to come, I would probably pick IOTA. But since we're only talking about 2018, I think I would put my money in Ripple. Well guys, those were my reasons for picking Ripple over IOTA. Which cryptocurrency, Ripple or IOTA, would you pick for 2018? Let me know in the comment section below. And as always, thank you for watching this video. Like, comment and subscribe. I'll see you next time.